this bad boy cranks out 2.4 gigawatts of power. Now that's enough to power 380,000 homes. Crazy. Money. Welcome back to the channel, everybody. My name is Max the Sensei, and in today's video, man, I want to show you one of the craziest clients I've ever shot for. Now, as you know, I'm a videographer based here in Dubai. I've been living in Dubai for almost 11 years, and I've shot for a million clients, a million brands, all right? But this one, this one is crazy. I love my friends going crazy. I gotta break on myself, I amaze me. I know I'm got something that y'all can phase me. I'm too dope like I'm back in the 80s. Okay, go call me and I'm gon' slide. Slide up with me for a hell of a ride. If you need a couple wins, they ain't doing it right. Get up my line, we gon' turn up the night. Good morning. Morning, reporting for duty. Today, we're shooting this amazing, beautiful power plant. Incredible. Number one in UAE, in the world. <laughs> Well, never in my life as a videographer based here in Dubai have I thought that I'm gonna have a chance to shoot these things. And in order for me to go inside and shoot, I had to go extensive background checks. I had to provide them my passport, my ID, my blood type. I had to wait for the shooting permit for six months months that's wild and once you enter you're not really allowed to use your phone or any other unauthorized camera and at the gates as you enter it's not security personnel it's the military this client has honestly blew my mind with the size of their premises and the things they do inside. Have you ever wondered how they make electricity here? How about drinking water? I've had the greatest opportunity in life to go see these power plants for myself and shoot. And in this video, I want to share some crazy, mind-blowing facts I found out about these power plants. And you know what's nuts? Not too many people know about it, even if you live here in UAE. I mean, I've been here for 11 years. I didn't know about it till I went to shoot. All right, here are the craziest facts that you didn't know about. I didn't know about the seven power plants around UAE. Hey, my AI voice. Yes, take it over. You got it, boss. Number one, Fujera F3 power plant. Fujera F3 is set to be one of the largest gas-fired combined cycle power plants in the UAE with a capacity of 2.4 gigawatts. It will supply electricity to approximately 380,000 households across the UAE. So this plant is so huge, it sits at 2 kilometers and 240 meters long, which is the equivalent of 22.4 football fields laid end to end. That's wild. Or you would need to stack about 2.7 Burj Khalifas end to end to reach that length. The Fujera power plant is absolutely huge. Don't ask me how I shot it. Number two, Shams Power Company. Here are some interesting facts about Shams Power Plant. Shams One is a 100 megawatt concentrated solar power CSP plant, one of the largest in the world, and it supplies clean electricity to over 20,000 households. The plant displaces around 175,000 tons of CO2 annually, contributing significantly to reducing the UAE's carbon footprint. The plant covers an area of 2.5 square kilometers, equivalent to about 285 football fields. Okay, that's a lot to unpack. So Shams 1 is a 100 megawatt concentrated solar power plant, one of the largest in the world. So what does that even mean? Well, with 100 megawatts of power, you could charge 20 million smartphones, or you could charge 2 million laptops, or even better, with 100 megawatts, you can charge 1,300 Teslas in one day. Man, my little brain cannot comprehend these numbers. All right, AI voice, next one. Number three, Almurfa Power and Desalination Plant. Here are some interesting facts about the Almurfa Power and Desalination Plant. The plant has a 1,600 megawatt installed capacity, which can supply up to 10% of Abu Dhabi's power requirements during peak capacity. It produces 52.5 million imperial gallons of water per day, which is approximately 200,000 cubic meters per day, covering over 5% of Abu Dhabi's Dhabi's water generation. Okay, so 200,000 cubic meters of desalinated water per day must be a lot. But how much really? Well, that's enough to fill 200 million one liter water bottles, or it could fill approximately 1.33 million bathtubs. So 200,000 cubic meters of water is enough to fill about 80 Olympic swimming pools. Or it could provide drinking water for 100 million 
people per day. Or it's enough water to hydrate one million elephants per day. Absolutely insane. Number four, Shuei Hot Power Station. Here are some key facts about the Shuei Hot Power and Water Complex. The complex consists of three plants, each with a power capacity of 1,600 megawatts, giving a combined total output of 4.8 gigawatts. Shuei Hot S1 and S2 together produce 459,000 cubic meters of desalinated water per day. This provides about 10.7% of Abu Dhabi's total water production. And this plant is really huge. It's 5.5 square kilometers is huge. So then how many Colosseums can fit inside it? You ready? Approximately 210 Colosseums can fit inside the Shuahat power station or around 95 Great Pyramids of Giza. 21 Eiffel Tower Parks in Paris. Bro, this area is so huge you can fit 20.2 million people inside it standing shoulder to shoulder or you can fit 16 of me. Because, you know, Shuei Hat Power Station, absolutely nuts. AI voice, next one. Number five, Mazdar City, 10 megawatt solar photovoltaic farm. It was the first grid connected renewable energy project in the UAE and the largest of its kind in the Middle East when it was inaugurated in 2009. The plant generates approximately 17,500 megawatt hours of clean electricity annually, enough to offset around 15,000 tons of carbon emissions per year. So you ready? Because I have some numbers with 17,500 megawatt hours, get this, a Tesla Model 3 could drive for about 130.7 million kilometers. That's enough to travel to the moon and back 170 times. Now for the fun part. If that amount of energy were to be stored in one single giant Tesla Model 3 battery, you could drive it for 23,300 years, non-stop at 60 kilometers an hour. Now let's explore some creative comparisons for 15 tons of CO2 emissions. You ready? A single mature tree absorbs about 22 kilograms of CO2 per year. Now, to offset 15,000 tons of emissions per year, just like the Mazdar plant does, guess, guess how many trees you would need. Take a guess. You would need 682,000 trees to offset 15 tons of CO2 emissions per year. Look, I ran out of words. I don't have any other adjectives to describe this. So AI voice. Next one. Number six, Aldafra PV2 solar power plant. Here are some interesting facts about the Aldafra PV2 solar power plant. The plant has an impressive capacity of 2.1 gigawatts, making it the world's largest single site solar power plant. The energy generated is enough to power approximately 200,000 households across the UAE. Aldafra PV2 helps displace 2.4 million tons of CO2 emissions annually, which is equivalent to removing around 470,000 cars from the roads. The total area of this enormous power plant is 20.72 square kilometers. Now let's break down how many people, famous sites and Tesla Model 3s can fit in the 20.72 square kilometers of Aldafra solar power plant. 82.9 million people could fit inside this power plant if they stood shoulder to shoulder. How many Max the Sensei could fit inside? <laughs> Maybe 74 because you know. You could fit 47 Vatican cities in this area or about 4.4 million Teslas if they were parked bumper to bumper. You know how many Titanics can fit inside this area? Take a guess. 2,751 Titanics. 2,751. How many Taj Mahals? How many Taj Mahals? 122 Taj Mahals. You live in Dubai, you've been to Palm Jumeirah, you know how huge it is, right? Palm Jumeirah, it's huge. How many Palm Jumeiras can fit inside? Take a guess. 3.6. 3.6. Man, this power plant, it's absolutely insane, all right? It's insane. It's just insane. This area is crazy. It's, it's insane. It's nuts. I mean, look at this power plant. How many solar panels do you think it has? Take a guess. The Aldafra PV2 solar power plant has 4 million. 4 million solar panels. 4 million. 4 million. Which means at its peak, it's creating 2.1 gigawatts of power. 
power. You know the crazy things you could do with 2.1 gigawatts of power? You could charge 420 million smartphones or 42 million laptops. 2.1 gigawatts of power could charge 28,000 Tesla Model 3 simultaneously. <laughs> or a single Tesla Model 3 could travel 15.68 million kilometers, which is enough to circle the Earth 391 times. 391 times. How many times have you circled the Earth? Now, 4 million solar panels is a lot. But how much really? Well, if we stacked all 4 million solar panels back to back in one line, it would cover 6,800 kilometers. That's like going from Dubai to Tokyo. It will be that long. It would cover almost twice the width of United States of America. Now, if the 4 million solar panels were to be stacked on top of each other, it would reach 160 kilometers. It would take 18, 18 Mount Everests to cover that distance, 18. Or 193 Burj Khalifas. You know how tall Burj Khalifa is? One Burj Khalifa is very tall, 800 something meters. Put 193 Burj Khalifas and only then you can reach 160 kilometers height of 4 million solar panels stacked upon each other. I was afraid I was not gonna finish the sentence. <laughs> I did it. <laughs> Aldafra solar power plant, truly mind boggling. And I'm so freaking lucky to have had the chance to go and shoot it. AI voice, I think it's the last one. Number seven, Altawila power and desalination complex. Here are some interesting facts about the Altawila power and desalination complex. The complex has a power generation capacity of 3.89 gigawatts, making it one of the largest power plants in the region. The desalination facility can produce 909,200 cubic meters of desalinated water per day, enough to meet the water demand of over 350,000 households, making it the world's largest reverse osmosis desalination plant. The complex spans 1.02 square kilometers, housing both power and desalination facilities. These impressive stats highlight the vital role Altawila plays in providing both electricity and fresh water to the UAE. Let's compare 3.89 gigawatts of power to the energy released by the Mount Vesuvius that destroyed Pompeii in 79 AD. Let's see, how powerful is 3.89 gigawatts? You ready? So get this, it would only take 300 days of full operation at 3.89 gigawatts of power to reach the exact same destructive power of Mount Vesuvius that destroyed Pompeii. Only 300 days. I mean, this is how crazy this power plant is. If you could use this power all in one day, you could cook 940 million omelet plates in one day. That's a lot of eggs. Here's my favorite. If you could use 3.89 gigawatts of power all in one day, you could cook 94 million chicken biryanis. That's a lot of biryani, man. But you know what goes well with chicken biryani? Karak chai. Take a guess, how many karak chai can you make with this amount of power? You ready? Are you sitting down? 1.87 billion karak chai cups. 1.87 billion. 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 Now that's freaking delicious yo my people thanks a lot for watching i hope you enjoyed this video i hope it was a little entertaining and yo help me out with a name for my ai voice i don't know what to call it drop your name suggestions in the comments down below and we'll pick the coolest name i'm max the sensei leave a like on this video i'll catch you next time I love my going crazy. i gotta break on myself i amaze me i know i'm guys under me i can phase me i'm too dope like i'm back in the 80s okay go call me and i'm gonna slide